It's about growing up and the heart of a girl, the heart of a girl, a brave, brave girl, who's trying to work out how to be. And we meet her at a patch in the store, at the point in her life where all of us, girls and boys, need to rebel, need to say, that's not what I want. I want something different because I'm different. I'm not like you. And it's that moment that we find her. Queen Eleanor, or just Eleanor, um, is married to Fergus and he's he's a great big beast of a man and always fighting and always getting into trouble and she absolutely adores him. So there's great love between these two and it's produced a really terrific daughter. Um, but, she, you know, Eleanor's had to... She's had to um, close her doors a little bit, you know, and so she's always saying to to her daughter, look, you know, it's not for you to, I don't want you always out with the boys with your bow and arrow and rushing off with the horses and doing this, that, she's quite a tomboy, she's very physical, very active, very brave girl, and she doesn't want to be like Eleanor. My daughter, Merida, is played by um, a young actress called Kelly MacDonald, who's one of my favourite people in the world. She played Evangeline in a film I did called Nanny McPhee. She was the, the, the servant who ends up marrying the dad. And um, I love her because she's a, an exquisite human being, but also a wonderful actor, just wonderful, because there's nothing actressy about her. Um, there's nothing precious about her. She's very direct. She's very clean and clear and loving and, and you know, strong and original and rather eccentric in a way. I like her very much because she doesn't conform to anything in particular. She's just a remarkable woman and um, therefore she's the perfect choice for this very remarkable girl. The character of Scotland, because it is really a character in the film, um, has been brilliantly realised because they all went. They didn't look it up in a book or think they went off to Scotland. Brenda and Catherine went off and spent all this time looking at the different landscapes and saying, well, we'd like that for that bit. And they, So they, they went and they addressed the, the landscape with the story. They said, right, this part of the story will just be right here. And that's there, therefore, there's a, a real connection with the, with the, with the countryside there. Um, and of course they loved it, as everyone does, because it's the most beautiful country in the world.